and President Nigerian Labour Congress has called for a unified basic salary structure for both the public and private sector. Ajarawu is charged in the ongoing North East Zonal public hearing on national minimum wage, made the call in Yola on Thursday. He said the market hearing should be conducted in all zones as without the market hearing, the aim of the public hearing on minimum wage will be repeated. From all over the country in all the zones, so that we will do what is called market hearing. If we don't do market hearing, the essence of this public hearing will be defeated. We need to go to the market and ask them how much is the value of rice? How much is the pay of Gary in that order? So this is a suggestion in addition to public hearing that we do market here. And if we balance the two, I think we'll be somewhere. And the executive governor of Bauchi State, Senator Bala Mohamed, said Nigeria is suffering in terms of food security policy and should be adequately enforced, adding that to enhance high productivity in public and private sectors, the workers need to be motivated for hard work and honesty by reintroducing awards and prompt promotions. We don't need to be told that there is hardship. It is tangible. You can touch it. You can see it. People are suffering. Nigerians are suffering. We are not talking from the point of view of opposition. We are saying the reality. Mr. President and our chairman, Nigerians are looking up to us as leaders. And leadership is not a job. It's not deception or delusion. Politics must have fidelity, sincerity. We pledge to work for Nigerians. But yes, as we do that, we should always, always look at what we have, what we can generate, where we have found ourselves. Governor Amadou Fintiri of Adamawa State described the town hall meeting as timely, going by the economic situation in the country. Fintiri, represented by his deputy, Professor Kalitapwa Farota, said the government has the right thing to do is what they are doing to get the heartbeats of the people and bring help and a score. We all agree as governors and as people at the helm of affairs that God has allowed to lead the Northeast and Nigeria at this time, that the times are difficult. And there's no exception, the times are really, really difficult. And as a government, both at the state and the Northeast and the national level, I think the right thing to do at this time is what we are doing, to get the heartbeat of our people and to bring help and support. I don't think there's any figure that can be paid to a civil servant that will be convenient or that will be comfortable. In attendance at public hearing where the executive governor of Bauchi State, Senator Obala Mohamed, deputy governor of Adamawa State, Professor Kalitapwa, George Ferrota, heads of service of Boronu, Yobe, Gombe and Taraba States and about 18 selected associations presented their positions on the new national minimum wage in the country.